Qatar has ruled out all chances of normalization with Syria's Bashar al-Assad regime. One of Qatar's biggest car dealerships has been hit with a whopping 36 fines. Scientists have made yet another discovery on the moon. And finally, Hernan Crespo picks up his first silverware as manager of al Duhail. Hi, it's Ali. This is The Roundup. Here are today's top stories. Qatar will not be betraying victims of the Syrian crisis by normalizing with Bashar al-Assad's regime. That's according to Qatar's foreign ministry spokesperson, Dr. Majid al-Ansari. He said Doha's position is clear and consistent and is not affected by any interactions taking place between Damascus and other Arab nations. This comes as Arab countries such as Jordan and the UAE, as well as Egypt, have made moves to reconnect with the Syrian regime after more than a decade of no diplomatic relations. Qatar has also been consistent in its calls for investigations into crimes committed against the Syrian people since 2011. Now, customers who have taken their complaints to social media have been heard. The Ministry of Commerce and Industry said it issued 36 fines to one of the biggest car dealerships in Qatar and referred it to authorities to take legal action. Customers of the unnamed dealership had complained of delays in the delivery of their cars despite making the full payments. The ministry said the company failed to adhere to their side of the contract, which is a breach of the consumer protection law. We all no, there's water on the moon, but scientists have now discovered how it is stored. According to a study by scientists in China, tiny glass beads in the lunar soil on the moon could be holding trillions of pounds of water. The discovery was made after scientists analyzed the first lunar soil samples to be returned to Earth since the 1970s. And finally, the Uridu Cup brought down its curtains on Tuesday night, with league leaders Al Dihail dominating dark horses Om Salal in a 1-0 win. Nam Taihi's first half shot proved to be the difference as Argentinian coach Hernan Crespo won his first title while in charge of the club. Om Salal bravely saw off a horde of Al Duhail attacks, but in the end were unable to get on the score sheet themselves. Thank you for joining us. For more of our stories, head over to our website www.dohanews.co. Have a great day.